Hello everyone. Uh, this is uh, going to be part 20, I believe, of uh, Transport Fever 2 Megalomania. So we're sitting here uh, over by Patterson, uh, where uh, the uh, excitement for today's uh, episode is going to start out. Uh, previously, I uh, connected up this main line that we're currently looking at, uh, at the uh, other end of it to the uh, to the previously constructed network and there's one more uh, cross link that I want to build between this line and the rest of the system oh hello auto save uh, strikes again and that is uh, I want to bring a line up from Patterson around here uh, hit uh, West uh, Covina and then uh, link up with the existing uh, connection that I plumbed in last time to Fremont. That will uh, basically uh, tie in most of the uh, stuff over on this part of the map and uh, the passenger stuff. So uh, that means uh, well, what I uh, what I need to do is um, well plumb in another platform over here so uh, here we go uh, configure and put a uh, tracks on here yep like that good yep that's good now that's going to be a terminating platform uh, wait, I'm going to uh, head off this way. Um, yeah, so uh, what I should do is uh, relink these things over to these two uh, platforms. So uh, when this train leaves, uh, has left, I will uh, do that. Uh, what do you mean when this train has left? You just took the tracks out before it left. Oh, well, yeah, I suppose I did. Now, uh, I just need to uh, connect this one up to here and this one up to here. Let's uh, keep them together longer. And then uh, take these out. Right, and here I need to uh, connect this up here, and uh, again this up to here, and then uh, this obviously uh, is broken. Uh, really? It's not showing the... Uh, Oh, manage line. This should fix it. Yeah, good. Uh, right. So that gets the uh, the existing uh, connection through. Uh, what I need to do is uh, connect that platform up so that I can get uh, I can fling trains onto it. So I'll do this and this. Good, so it'll connect up from that direction, and, well, I should plumb a couple signals back in here. So we'll need one of these here. And one of these here. No. Uh, here. Right. Uh, and I'm still going to put the uh, signals here. Okay, so now uh, that's got uh, that uh, set up. So now I can bring this out. Uh, which way to... So I want to come through that way. So I want a relatively sharp curve here. Although it's still showing 120, so I'm not sure how relatively sharp that actually is. Now, uh, let's see. I also will want this double tracked, so let's uh, let's do that while I'm at it. 
Uh, right. Well, let's try this this way. Okay, that looks like it works. Now, uh, this road's in the way. So, take it out. Yeah, that was my uh, general uh, idea, to, is to take it out. Okay. And you're going to build a track straight through that gap, are you? Well, I'm going to head for the gap anyway. Doesn't seem like uh, adding extraneous curves is necessary on the flat ground here. And just for shiggles, I will reconnect that. Maybe not that way. Eh, kind of like that. Good. Uh, right. Now, I'm going to need a bridge, and then how am I going to come into uh, West uh, Covina here? Well, I'm going to come out of there, I'm going to come along this side. So, I... But, if I come in this side, I avoid the road. Okay, so that's, that's how it's going to work. So, uh, first thing I'm going to do is plumb in one of these right here like that okay and I'm going to also add one of these and naturally I need a, a Dewey well you're still calling those Deweys are you well, sure, why not? And why are you putting it on the side road there? Because I feel like it? Oh, well, in that case, have at it. Can you get it to fit? Uh, no. You can't get it to fit there without demolishing a building. Why are you worrying about that? Because I don't want to demolish a building. Well, uh, right. Ah, what? There we go. That gets it in there. Uh, that was way more work than it was worth, naturally. Which is why I did it. Did you now? Yeah, that's what I'm going to say and stick with it. Okay. Now, I need a tram. Uh, I, I think the Petersburg one is probably gonna be the best option here uh, you're only going for one huh well that is uh, quite um, unusual well yeah I figured you know one will probably work so this is local West Covina uh, that's Crosstown a okay you now need to plumb in your rail station that is the general uh, idea. So you want two tracks on that, of course. Uh, yeah, because it's a through station. All uh, right. Well, that's a station. Good. Now you need to get your uh, tracks over to the uh, other side there. Yeah. And that's not going to be terribly difficult. That's what you think. Well, it's basically flat land, so how difficult could that be? I mean, we got the tracks over here, and the tracks over here, and we got, you know, something resembling water in the middle. So, you know, we could do this. Uh, well, not if you're going to collide with the water, you can't. Okay, well, that solves that, but it's not navigable. 
Well, there, if it is now, so what kind of a bridge are you going to put there? Well, uh, I'm obviously going to put bricks. Uh, interesting. Bricks, huh? Well, why not? Well, I suppose that is a, a good question. Why not? It's not like you have 293 million in the in the uh, bank. Well, exactly. So I can build whatever I bloody want. You sure about that now? Well, you know, the game's going to say uh, too much slope or something and cause trouble naturally at some point. Uh, no. Come at that from the other end because it's uneven. No, it's even. Okay. Let's see what this does. Well, that's tolerable. Okay. And uh, you, you need to put the second track on that. Well, yeah, I was getting to it. Just saying. Right, okay. Uh, you know, if you're going to you know, complete one of those roads, you should complete the other one too. Yeah, I was getting to it. Um, too bad it doesn't do those... Um, uh, spline things a little more uh, uh, readily uh, when you're uh, connecting something with a whacking great curve like that. Okay. Well, now I need to get up to Fremont, which is going to need another platform. So we'll configure this. Well, that's uh, a track. And that's a platform and that's an underpass thingy oh wait well, you're putting a roof on it too are you well why not you know consistency and all so now what are you gonna do well I'm going to build a track oh you have to get out of configuring the station first you know well yeah I do know that and I always forget about that so you brought a track out yep what is up with that? Stupid thing is, that would actually work. Uh, in the game, that is. But n no, we ain't doing that. Okay, that is better. Good, right. Uh, yeah. How are you, you got to crank it over this way. Well, we can do that. You know, it's not going to be fast. Well, it's right at the station. It doesn't need to be fast. Oh, you make a good point. Uh, right. What? What? Why isn't that? Why? Why wasn't that even snapping? That. Right. Now. Are you going to put a? Uh, you are. Uh, what? Uh, well, that doesn't fit. You're going to have to double slip that. You could move the signal. I could. Or I could come at it this way. Yeah. That works better. Uh, why are you doing that? So I can uh, link it every which way. Oh! Is that why? Uh, so I'm going to put a signal or three in here right right away while I'm thinking about it and I remember what I've done. Well, it's going to be a signal, not a signal or three. Well, yeah, you have a point. Oh, you, you, you cranked that around too far. Well, that's what the bulldozer's for. Well, you also have a valid point with that. Okay. Now we need to uh, bail around this, uh, uh, the toe of these hills here, which uh, is oh so terribly difficult. Yep, it definitely is oh so terribly difficult. Right. Well, that's uh, more tracks. Okay, and we need to keep coming along here. So I need to 
I need to line up kind of like this. Uh, you know, you're not uh, putting any uh, particular uh, concern into keeping this level. No, no, I'm not. Uh, I'm kind of past the point in the game where that's terribly critical. Uh, right. Uh, like the uh, rolling stock is up to the point where, or the uh, the the engines are up to the point where uh, they can handle uh, relatively uh, wavy uh, track. So there's no particular reason to be concerned about a little bit of up and down on the track. Uh, okay, so you've got around the hill. Uh, which track is that you're picking up? Okay, that's the right-hand one. Uh, you connected that to the right one. Did we get anything bizarre here? Not really. Okay. It's entirely possible the track is lower than it should be, but that's fine. Okay, that connects up the, uh, the tracks. So... Uh, that's a line that comes off from, uh, what is it, Patterson through West Covina and links up to Fremont. Okay, uh, you need to put some signals on that though. Well, I suppose I probably do, especially here. And now you need to put a bunch more. Do I? Well, I suppose it wouldn't be a bad idea. Uh, anyway, while I'm doing this, uh, I'm going to uh, blather on a bit about things. So, uh, what my ultimate plan for this uh, series is, it's to uh, get all of the towns connected into a functional passenger network uh, with rail and uh, a few strategic uh, airports and then to see uh, what that does for town growth uh, among other things and that's generally what my goal is for these uh, these types of, of games you know get things connected up I uh, I've got a fair chunk of the uh, connections active now uh, this map doesn't give a lot of opportunities for water uh, transport, so there won't be boats on this one. I think I'll probably do another series after this one, though, and that will have a different type of map. One where I can't rely almost exclusively on rail and trucks. And that should be a... Uh, somewhat different uh, challenge. I might do uh, another one where uh, I focus on cargo uh, for the most part and completing cargo chains uh, instead of uh, you know instead of uh, focusing on uh, passengers. I happen to enjoy building passenger networks however so uh, for the most part that's probably what I'll do. Uh, now, that looks like you've got enough signals on there for uh, 12 rail lines. Well, yeah, uh, and, and that's fine. That's kind of the goal. That's the goal, is it? To have lots of signals. Well, it was kind of the goal there. Now, the question is, where are you going to fling your train from? Uh, well, if you connect things up here... like this and like this you can actually uh, fling the train up from either end of this uh, this main line and you know what I think that's probably a sensible thing to do you think that now well yeah uh, okay, so you have a uh, you have a depot at Louisville, and you have a depot 
way over yeah uh but seriously all the others are just as far away so you know you could build another one i could uh, but i'm not going to uh right so i'm gonna buy a train now what have i got here uh steam what have i got i have i have the borsig which does 45 uh, too bad the mogul's not here yet. Uh, that does 64, so I think I'm going to be going with the PV. Yeah, I think I'm going with the PV. Add. Uh, passengers. Uh, I could go with this, which does 60. Yeah, I think I'll go with that. Uh, right, what's this one? Yeah. Uh, so, so you're going five on there? No, going six. Uh, just because. Uh, you know, it's not like I have 302 million in the bank or anything. Now, how many of those do you need? I think three. Uh, why do you think three? Well, mostly because of the length of the line. Uh, it's two towns, but it's a really long line. So, uh, so you're, you're going for it, okay. Uh, right. Uh, where's Patterson? There it is. Uh, so you're going to add a new line, uh, which is going to start there and go there and go there and go there. That's a line. Well, you might have been able to get away with two trains on there, you know. This will be the uh, West Covina link. Okay. ICR West Covina link. Right. Uh, good. Now let's uh, go over here and see where's, oh, there's the train. Yep, that's one of them. Good. Uh, let's up the tempo. And, you know, I don't think I need to, you know, ride this the whole way. Uh, let's uh, look at it this way. You know, I probably said this previously, but this doesn't look half bad. It's coming in between the uh, the mountains like that. Uh, yeah, that doesn't look half bad. It actually looks kind of like you might actually see out in the countryside in the mountains. Uh, I do know a little bit about what things look like in, in the mountains on account of living not so terribly far away from uh, a mountain range. And it's not like there's a rail line up a nearby mountain pass or anything. Okay, so we're coming through a town. Burbank. And then, uh, yeah. Okay, so uh, once I've uh, seen that this uh, train behaves, I'm going to... Uh, go and look at some of the stuff from before and see how it's doing. Uh, now we've got trees in our face and all of that jazz. Right. So next up it next up should be Patterson, I think. Is it? No. Yes. No. Yes, it is. You're sure about that now? Well, no. Yes. It is. It stopped at the wrong damn platform. Why the hell did it... What? Why did it stop at that platform? That's... what? Terminals. 
No, it's right. What? Why? Oh. I left a signal. No. No, that's uh that's not it. Well, that one can definitely have a signal there. This one. That one's right. Okay. Why did it go to this platform? That doesn't make any bloody sense. It should have come across to here. There's no... Oh, no, there's nothing blocking it. What the... Okay, I don't get it when it does that sort of thing. Uh, okay, so I'm going to have to... Uh, do something like this. Just to get it out. Collision. Okay... I have to do something like that to get it out. What? That doesn't make any sense. Reverse. Okay. Well, that clearly works. That one's leaving. That one is arriving. That didn't make any bloody sense. Oh, come on. Okay. I clearly have an issue there. Okay. Right. I don't get it. Why there was there were crossovers going this way, so there's no reason it shouldn't have gone to the correct platform. Uh, so it looks like they still have a bug related to that. Uh, this is West Covina, right? Yep, it is. Uh, so yep. Uh, this will be the slightly more interesting leg of this one. Uh, we're going across a uh, lowland here. We're actually below water level here by the look of it. And then... Uh, then we'll climb up to a little bit more sensible elevation, eventually. And then go around the toes of the toe of these hills here. Right? The foot of the hills. Or the foothill, even. Well, not really. But we'll go around the hills. Uh, some fairly decent cuts here. That's not too bad. We got trees hanging out and uh, stupid rocks. Right. So, that's... Uh, it looks like that's going to work. So, good. Uh, well, we should be seeing Fremont in view now. And, oh look, there's a train from Grand Rapids, I think it is. Uh, so, let's see. We come roaring in here. And... Yep, okay, so far so good. We pick up some passengers, 39 so maybe the longer trains are not so ridiculous. What? I don't like that. Okay. Uh, I'm going to fix this first. And then and I'm going to fix that with a waypoint here. 
And then I'm going to grab the line, manage it, and after Fremont, I'm going to go via the way station. There we go. That's the way I wanted it set up. Okay. Uh, it doesn't really matter, but uh, quite frankly, I think it's better that way. Now, uh, good. So that's working. Uh, assuming that the stuff isn't pulling into the wrong station, the wrong platform over here, which it, sh it shouldn't because it can't. Okay, good, good, good. Uh, right. So that's that, uh, and that's probably enough uh, substantial uh, tinkering around uh, in this, uh, this particular uh, um, episode. But I do want to address a comment I got on a previous video uh, referring to when I plumbed in this here, uh, this here uh, forest uh, to the uh, sawmill here and how I ran it around the uh, tools factory uh, to the sawmill and the commenter observed that uh, instead of deadheading the uh, uh, the the train all the way back to the forest, I could instead have it picking up uh, uh, the the lumber here and uh, drop and, and going through this station and dropping it off here. And uh, it turns out, you know, that's uh, somewhat valid, and I could definitely do that. Now, uh, what I want to check here, okay, so this is maxed out, uh, so it can't level up any further, uh, although production can increase just a little bit. Uh, I need to transport a bit more. Now, uh, the, the, the commenter suggested I could be making more money if uh, I had the planks coming back this way and drop, you know, on this train, and dropping them off here and that's true uh, I definitely could and why I, I didn't do it or comment on it at the time is I didn't notice that I could do that yeah that's right I didn't notice it and you know I'll be honest about that but you know what I'm not gonna do that uh, it's not like I have 336 million in the bank at the moment uh, and also it allows me to tune the uh, transport between the uh, uh, the sawmill and the uh, tools factory uh, a little more uh, finely compared to if I also have to uh, maintain the uh, uh, the forest connection now I'm sure somebody's gonna say yeah but uh, you only need two forests to run a sawmill and if you're running the full amount for the forest to the sawmill and the full amount from the other forest to the sawmill, you'll have exactly the full amount from the sawmill going back. Yes, yes, uh, I would. Uh, but uh, I'm not actually going to do that. What I am going to do, though, is uh, take a look at this line. The rate is not high enough, so I'm going to take a look, I think, a third vehicle on that, a third train on there, uh, pin that, out of curiosity, uh, I've got three, I've got three trains on there. You know what? The commenter actually might have a point here. Yeah, I think there's a point, that, point to be had there. If I uh, combine the two lines, uh, but again, it's not like I have 345 million in the bank or something. Now I still, I'm still going to need another train if I do that, just to get the rate up to 400. Um, but yeah, yeah, that actually isn't such a, a nut a, a, a nut so idea uh, now that I now that I observe it 
So, yeah. So how would I do that semi-sanely here? Well, how would I rejigger that? Well, I I crank this around into here. I uh, I need a through track for going this way. And okay. Well, in that case, you know what? I'm going to do that and just uh, see how that works. So I'm going to put a track here. Uh, and that's just so that I can keep everything all nice and tidy. Uh, you go away. Uh, right. So I will uh, plumb in a uh, track to here. Yeah. And I will plumb in a track to here. Okay, yep. Uh, that should mean, with that track there, uh, if I... Uh, okay, if I take out these signals here... Because they're in the way. Then, if I bring this one around, okay. I bring this around like this. Then, I can take this bit of track out, theoretically. So, uh, what happens if I do this? Well, I didn't break anything. So, I'll take this one out. Okay. Right. Now. Uh, that means I just... I should be able to take this one out without breaking anything. Yeah, that looks like that works. Okay. Uh, yeah, right, okay, I think that'll, that will, uh, will work. Uh, so I'll, uh, stick a couple signals in like this, and a signal here, and now, uh, what I'm going to do, I'm going to pause the game while I do this, uh, the sawmill to, uh, uh, tools factory here. I'm going to uh, sell. I'm not going to sell those. I'm going to move them to the other line, which is uh, called uh, uh, this one, right? I'm going to move those to. Uh, cargo, SA Forest, Sawmill. Yep. Okay. And then I'm going to manage, no, manage the line. And from the sawmill, it's going to go here. Right. Uh, okay, now if I, uh, I need the, uh, okay, manage this line, I can remove that, yeah, okay, now I have too many trains on the line, I'm sure, uh, but, go. Uh, right. Uh, I think I only need four trains on the line, so that one's got logs. That one has nothing. Okay. Uh, that one, train 28, manage, sell. 
Okay, that's 465. That should be a high enough uh, uh, rate. Okay. Uh, in theory, that should uh, that should get everything uh, uh, working. So, if I come on, there we go. Uh, right. Uh, yeah, I can possibly improve that too, but anyway, so that is coming in there with 105 uh, logs, and then it's going to uh, drop them off, and it'll pick up a bunch of planks, uh, only 77, that's uh, fine, uh, I just want to see if it's going to the right place. As I can shorten these trains to uh, uh, balance things out once the uh, line is uh, settled properly. So, so this is coming along here on nicely highlighted tracks because I left the line open. Right. So, ticking along here with hovering rocks and all of that jazz. Hollow hovering rocks by the look of it. Right. So we come along here, and then we uh, shift around to the platform, uh, and then we drop off the lumber, and then we head onward to the forest. Yes. Well. This appears to be working. Uh, okay. Now, uh, to the person that made the comment, I've forgotten your name already. Uh, I do appreciate it. Uh, this is something I hadn't even noticed when I was uh, messing with things. But uh, the, the math should work out so that uh, all of the uh, so that the total uh, volume is right and that's that makes the uh, the track set up here look just a little bit less uh, bizarre right good uh, that was probably worth doing. Uh, I just take a look here. How's the, uh, okay. And that should improve the throughput on those lines as well, just because I added more capacity. So it'll help here. Uh, and Long Beach will probably gain as well. I clearly need to, uh, uh get more tools production online at some point as well. Anyway. Uh, I'll probably end up with a with a hub station up over at the tools factory. Anyway, that's going to be all for uh, for this time, I think. Uh, yeah. Uh, so let's uh, let's just uh, you know camp out at a uh, a station here. Let's just camp out at McAllen uh, just for fun. Uh, how's McAllen doing? Yeah, that's not so bad. Uh, so camp out here for a bit. And uh, watch all the traffic running around doing things. And uh, that's probably... Yeah, uh, that that's all for, for this time, uh, for sure. Uh, you know, episodes long enough. Uh, next time around, I think uh, I'll either be uh, plumbing in even more towns into the rail network, uh, or I'll spend some time optimizing all of this. Uh, I haven't decided yet. Uh, tomorrow uh, should be another episode of Surviving Mars, and then Friday uh, should be the next episode of this. Uh, and if you have any ideas for uh, what to 
what you want me to try to 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 do with the, the next series of Transport Fever Two, uh, and let me know. Uh, you know, leave a comment or something. Uh, it'll uh, it'll certainly uh, give me some ideas that I don't currently have. So yay, uh, ideas are good. Anyway, uh, that's all for this time. Uh, see you next time.